गाइज डू यू वॉन्ट टू नो हाउ टू एड पाइथन इंटरप्रेटर इन विजुअल स्टूडियो कोड सो दिस वीडियो इज फॉर यू हे गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल गाइज इन दिस वीडियो आई विल बी शोइंग यू हाउ यू कैन एड पाइथन इंटरप्रेटर इन विजुअल स्टूडियो कोड एंड हाउ यू कैन यूज इट फॉर क्रिएटिंग योर पाइथन प्रोजेक्ट्स सो लेट स्टार्ट द वीडियो सो गाइज फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू हैव टू इंस्टॉल पाइथन एंड विजुअल स्टूडियो कोड सो आई हैव ऑलरेडी इंस्टॉल पाइथन एंड बी एस कोड द लिंक फॉर द वीडियो आई हैव गिवेन इन डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स सर्टनली यू कैन वॉच दैट आई जस्ट स्टार्टेड माई सी एम डी एंड आई एम हियर शोइंग यू दैट आई एम ऑलरेडी हैविंग पाइथन इंस्टॉल सो दिस इज द लेटेस्ट वर्जन ऑफ पाइथन विच आई एम हैविंग सो आई एम क्लोजिंग दिस कमांड प्रॉम गाइज एंड नाउ आई एम स्टार्टिंग माई विजुअल स्टूडियो कोड आई हैव इंस्टॉल विजुअल स्टूडियो कोड रिसेंटली so here and it's showing me welcome screen so i'm going to quickly close this welcome screen if you want to know how to install vs code that link also i have given in description box now guys here you need to go to this tab that is extension tab so here search for python and now here you can see it's showing different extension select this one microsoft and click on this install so guys it will install a uh, python extension in your vs code using this you can run your python program so after installing this python extension we will be installing one more extension so if you want to uh, run your code whether it is java code or python code you require that extension so now i will be installing that extension before that i'm closing this welcome screen and here i'm searching for code runner so this extension is used for running your code so simply here you can see this uh, code runner and click on this install and here just select trust publisher and install so guys my code runner is also installed now the next part i will be showing you how to create your python program and how to run it so now here after this extension you can just come to this folder tab and here guys you can see it's showing me option open folder you can select from this option or you can go to file menu and select open folder and guys you can browse whatever folder you want so here i'm just selecting one of the folder on my desktop so here i am quickly creating one folder cs corner on desktop and i'm selecting this folder so just click on this select folder button so your folder is open over here you can see it's showing cs corner and it's showing me this message that trust the author of this files and folder so just check mark and click yes i trust the author so now your folder is open so guys now i'm going to click on this plus sign and here i'm going to create one python file so i'm giving name as hello and extension is .py and you can see my hello.py file has been created now in this i will be writing my python code so here simply i have given one print statement for printing some message so my code is done guys now i'm going to save this code so press control s or you can go to file menu and you can select the option save okay so guys now code is done we will run this so here at the top you can see there is a play option code runner play option so just select this and you can see your output in output tab guys so guys this way you can run your python file in your vs code editor but guys whenever you are creating project in python then you should create virtual environment for python rather than following this step so now i will be showing you how to create virtual environment so for that guys you need to just press control shift and p so guys you can see here it's showing me uh, this option and here just type python colon or simply python and here you can see different options we have so we will be selecting python colon create environment okay so using this option you can create virtual environment for python so just select this option guys and now here you can see we have one option vnb so create a vnb environment so just select this and guys here you will be seeing your interpreter whatever python has been installed on your system you will see here hence i told you to install python first so installation of python is mandatory now guys i'm going to select this and here you can see the process has been started it's showing me creating environment so guys it will take a while and guys you can see the environment has been created it's showing me the 
following environment is selected and here in guys you can see in your folder it's showing me dot v e n v file also so i'm just expanding this file you can see the available uh, files in v e n v so guys my virtual environment is ready to use you can see bottom right side here we have environment option i'm just selecting it and here you can see it's showing me two option one is my global python and another is my virtual environment python so global python is the python which is installed on your pc and virtual environment is the one which you created just now so we are going to use this virtual environment so now i am already having hello.py file i will be running this but you can see this hello.py is not inside my virtual environment so i will run this file so i'm just clicking on this play button so guys in you can see here in the output tab it's showing me global python and now what i'll do i'll create one python file in my virtual environment so i'm just expanding this and i'm adding one python file so just click on this add option and give the name so test.py is name and i'm just simply uh, printing one statement so code is done guys i've saved the code and i'm running this so so you can see now it's not using my global environment it's using virtual environment over here right similarly i'll just uh, take this hello.py into my this venv folder and i'm running this hello.py so it is not taking global python it is taking virtual environment python so guys this way you can add python interpreter in your visual code editor i hope guys by following my video you are able to do this if guys my video has really helped you don't forget to hit on like button if you have any query you can put in comment box and send me on my ig also guys you can share my videos to your friends and guys i'm there on different social media you can join me or follow me the link for all my social media is in description box and guys i have another coding channel code with sunita where i take coding in hindi certainly you can subscribe to that and guys if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit bell icon to receive notifications from my channel thank you guys for watching this video i'll see you in my next video till that bye bye take care keep learning and keep watching guys